Hi guys and welcome to the next episode of Scratch. Today we're going to I'm going to think of making a Dodger game where enemies come in from the top and you the hero has to defeat them. So, I already imported the characters just to save some time. And we got to make the sizes now. Yeah, I think 10 is really good. Okay. So we've got the Dodger Hero. And we gotta make this like 200. 2000, okay. Set to the highest point. So this is the top. The Dodger enemy is at the top. The enemy is at the top, you are at the bottom, uh, you are at the bottom-ish. So, when the green fly is clipped, we've got to do the arrow keys, we've got to code the arrow keys. So, or arrow keys. This is another way of doing the arrow keys, but there is actually two ways of doing it. Yeah, there's two ways of doing it. This is only one of the ways. It, it's um, a bit less convenient, but I just wanted to show there's two ways to do it. This is down arrow, right arrow, and left arrow. Okay, so if the key up arrow is pressed, looks, motion. Points in direction, up, which is zero degrees, and we need to move. 10 steps for now. No comments. Ah. Uh, okay, yeah, we could add some more. So we have the basic things. Down arrow is just straight down, which is 180 degrees. Right arrow is 90 degrees, and left arrow is negative 90 degrees. Let's check. It's not working. Okay, then let's try the other way. Do, 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 do. Because I'm using MacBook, it might be something might be wrong, so that might be the problem. Down arrow, right arrow, left arrow. That worked. Mm. Oops. Let's fix this. So motion it automatically goes to this is the starting point. It works. Okay. 
There we go. I made a bit more room for other things. So we coded the guy, your hero. Now we have to code the enemy. So we go here automatically. Wait, let me see if it's this one. No, it just automatically goes to 183. So I can't literally, I can't just turn it to hide because I don't want this one to show. I can't literally just turn it to hide. It won't work. It, the clones, you can't make the clones show. So we're going to set the ghost effect. Here it is. To 90. You can't see it but it's there you can't see it to the visible eye but it's still there okay, just to make sure it's not literally hiding it's there now forever wait This, no, wait, speed, seconds, then, wait, as it starts, hit speed to 10, six. speed to 6, so it waits 6 seconds, then, create clone, and when I start as a clone, Set ghost effect to zero. There we go, we've got a clone. It works. Okay, so ghost effect to zero. Now, because we want it to get faster every time, because six is a bit too much, change speed by negative. 0 0.7. Wait, we don't know. So it goes to fight to 0 just to see um, how if it does that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, let's get off. Yeah, okay, it's working. It's getting faster and faster every time. Okay. So now, we don't want it to move ten steps. So forever... If, no if, point in direction, random, I'm going to make it random, pick random, negative 90 to 90, which is like from here all the way to here, and move, um, steps okay that looks good now so let's play it
Maybe negative 90 to 90 doesn't work. Maybe it works now. <laughs> oh. This is going into those. Oh, maybe I will first. This is going like this instead of this. Let me try 90 to negative 90. That probably will not work. Same thing. Same thing happened. Oh. <laughs> negative 90 to 90 is like this. What would be like this? Maybe 90 to. Did you see? Shut up. Oh, there's one down there. Right there. Oh, right there. And all of you is going down there. Okay, let's try 100 now. Oh, there they are. Oh, wow. It worked. Oh, wow. Oh, look, there's one. Bam, bam, pop, 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 pop. There's another one at the same place. Right there. Yeah. Okay, this is working. We got this now. Figured out how to do it. So, we gotta make it be able to shoot. And. Oh, I figured out what I'm doing wrong. We don't want it to go like that or point in that direction. We want it to always point this way, and it starts pointing up this way. So we need to make it go to pick random. Okay, there we go. Go to from from negative two thirty seven. And then 240. Negative 240 to 240. Okay. Thirty, just to make it stay in the screen a bit more. And the Y is gonna be maybe So that's no, the Y's got to be 180. Not pick random. It's going to start at 180. No matter what. Okay. Okay. So that's working. It's up there. But when the speed the seconds gets negative, it gets a bit weird. So maybe not negative 0.7 because that's a bit too fast. Let's say that's your point. 
One five. Yeah. That's good. Damn. Yeah, that's good. Um. Now, just in case it goes less than, uh, it goes to zero. This is very annoying, as you can see. It's less than if speed is less than zero or equal to zero, then. Then, um, set speed to ah, let me do this again. Same thing I did in Garden Blue. So many variables. Okay. Speed of speed. So speed of speed set speed to speed of speed change speed of speed by negative this is going to make it so much more complicated, and I hate it more complicated than I have to, and I'm going to have to. Duplicate the entire thing. It's literally the same code. If speed of speed. This gets annoying sometimes. Sometimes. Other times it just makes the game more fun. This speed then set speed of speed to six. Yeah, here we go. I literally even made a speed of speed of speed, or yeah, same thing, in Garden Blue. So I wasted a bunch of time, but I mean, it makes the game more fun. So can't can't blame that. Okay, now we gotta make a way for the Dodger Hero to shoot or do something to the um. Dodge your enemy. So when the space key is pressed, broadcast met. Oh, well, I'll just call it one. Okay, my broadcast message one. And we're going to make a new sprite. It's just going to be a green line. Like that. But thicker. Okay, that's the bullet. Okay. Why is it not straight enough? Oops. Oh, well, I don't care anymore. Where is the bullet? 
why is it not there? Look at that. It's there, but not there. Anyway, um, why are you not there? Let me try this. It's still not there. Oh no. Something's wrong. It was very, very wrong. Well, I don't even care anymore. Let's just hope it works. I received message one. Show, go to, oh yeah. When this thing is clicked, just hide. When I receive message one, show. Go to the Dodger Hero, then show. Then. Oops. I might have made it this. What if you make it? Point in direction zero. Let's just see what it does. Oh, there. Why is it not there? I'm stuck. I did a few stuff before when I was trying to fix the laser, but it wouldn't work. Please try to tell me in the comments if you can figure out why it wasn't working. Anyway, um, so I tried to fix it, so I did it a different way. I'm doing it a different way.
instead of it touching the laser, it's just gonna touch the the the. It's just gonna touch the dodger itself. So when it touches the dodger hero, then hide. Set ghost effect to 100 and start some pop. Pop. Okay. So we've got the fighting action yet, but we need to make it so that he actually moves. I mean, the enemy actually moves. Um, so we're going to make it point in direction. Wait, oops. Let me. Yeah, I think. Point in direction. 180. And just in case, stop. Not all. Other scripts. This script. So stop the scripts in this script. I think. Okay. But I'm thinking of making it. And. Then oh. else block. So if else block, so we can have the moving code inside it too. Else just move. The moving code. Um. So um, I. I still gotta tinker with it, but for now it's It's zero point zero one seconds and new ten steps. Okay, the box. Okay, that's that's pretty fast. this because this moves a bit too fast for that. Nine steps. Yeah, so this is like the basic arcade game. That's the basic game. That's all? I guess. So we have, a, I got a few more minutes, so I'm just going to add the ending. It's 
So we're going to need another if then else block. And we're going to need to change a bit more stuff. If touching the edge or the bottom, since we're going to have to change this, this guy moves a bit down to maybe one. Um, 65, yeah, we're going to have to fix it, it's pretty good, ah, I need to fix 65, let me go that to 165 too. And I forgot to make it so it's touching edge, the bottom edge. Then I have to new, have it a new sound. And uh, no. Place on alert until done. Place on alert until done again. Place on alert. So it's like wah, wah, wah. Stop. And then just delete message one. New message. And Broadcast and and wait. Hello. Broadcast. Sorry, that's my sister. Okay. When I received end. Oh wait, no, no, they're not going to do anything. And we need to hide. Fix the name. There are no enemies. Oh, oh, what are you doing? Okay, let's see. Now let's see the end. Okay, so um, when I receive end, then there's no sounds. There's no sound. 
Pharisee and then And so the game ends. Ah, oh, we should make a backdrop. So we gotta duplicate this. And so the game ends. Once one clicked. Looks which backdrop? It's a backdrop. One. I'm gonna receive and switch backdrop to backdrop and. That's good. Full screen mode. No. Games I make. Oh yeah, I gotta stop the game. <laughs> Forgot about that. So that's it for today, but you can make all the kinds of variations you like and make it your own. You can add a timer. You can add tons of stuff. Scoreboard. No, 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 no. That's all we have for today, but remember to watch our next video and subscribe. Thank you. Bye-bye.